Hi there, it's me, Grammy Vulture, and welcome. Today, I want to focus on making my Chinese Zodiac plushy horse. January 28th is fast coming upon me, and it's also Chinese New Year this year for 2017. It's the year of the rooster. We are going to make a horse because that's which animal I'm on. I have my material. Let me just show you. I'm going to draw my horse. I have my yarn that I'm going to use for the mane and the tail. Oh, we forgot ears. Well, I'll we'll have to put the ears with the tail. Maybe. Maybe we'll do some felt ears. And we just need one of these on the fold. Mine just likes to be the same length. There. As far as the mane, I was thinking I was going to crochet a chain. I don't know what size this crochet hook is because I made it myself out of a chopstick probably 20 years ago. Whittled it. Okay, I'm just going to end it there. So I'm just going to go in. And pull some of this through. Make a knot. Cut them the same size. There, that's going to be part of our mane. I can trim it down later, so I'm going to try to leave it a little bit long. And I'm just going to put maybe two in each link. This may take a while, so I'll be back. I have the mane, the tail, the body pattern and the side patterns with the holes marked for the eyes and the eyes. I cut these ears out of black felt. I think they're going to be a great contrast when they're put around the mane on the front. There, there it is with the tail. Okay, now we need a horse body in there, okay? So I'm, I'm ready to cut it out. Sorry, I, I love to be silly. Okay, I'll be back. <laughs> Yay! Okay, so I have the belly of the beast. The top. So, I think I'm going to start by putting those fancy eyes on here and here. Then the mane and tail will have to be set inside so I can sew around. And I'm going to probably leave the belly open. We'll have us a cute little horsey in no time. Here it is. Here's my horsey. I have the eyes. I put the ears and the mane in there. And the tail, I've got it pinned. The belly's pinned. It's all pinned, it's all pinned and ready for sewing. There's my horsey. <laughs> I think his eyes are gonna be a little cockeyed, but he's so cute. He's so cute, wait till you see. I can't wait for you to meet him. So I'm gonna just um, go over the mane really slowly probably just um just twisting with the machine handle but i'm gonna start there once i get all the pins out of this i'll be able to sew it again if i missed a piece I'll be able to um, go back and sew where I missed. But right now, it's crucial that I use the pins so that I can hold the things together. So, I'm gonna sew. So, I'm gonna sew. <laughs> I'll be 
deck. Okay, here it is. I left one of the sides open. Oh, I think I need to go over this part right here. Just a fuzz. Just a fuzz. There we go. Now, I'm super excited to see what this is going to look like. Here's the nose. <laughs> Tail. I know there's four legs in here somehow. I think he's cute. I think he's gonna be really cute. He's gonna have a big face. But you know, some people have to have big faces. Or some horses. Sometimes you just need a big face. Okay, I'm gonna put some stuffing, fluffing stuff in there. And I'll be back. I am proud to present to you. The Chinese Zodiac Horse Plushie. What? Well. <laughs> I think he's adorable. He, it, she. Yeah, I don't know. Anyway. So, I left the main. What if the person who gets this wants to cut it themselves? Um, I thought the same thing about the tail. I left it looped. However, just like with all my Zodiac plushies, it is not a toy. Worked really well. I just sewed it in. When I sewed it together, the nose, he has a big nose. I could shorten it and sew it shorter, but I like it. I like his big horsey nose big horsey nose. This little horsey was super fun. There's someone special that's going to have you, hopefully, loves you too. Anyway, mm, I'll fill you with hugs mm, and send you on your way. And when you get there, send me a postcard and let me know what your name is. All right. Say goodbye. <laughs> Gotta go. See you later. Love you. Bye.